Grayson, what's going on today? What are you going to do today? Soccer. <gasps> soccer? Are you going to play soccer? Yeah. Oh my goodness, are you so excited? Show me your shirt. Is that your jersey? Yeah. Obviously, Tim Hortons is... <laughs> Sponsoring their soccer team because it says Tim Hortons and then on the back it says Timbits. <laughs> I think he could actually get free Timbits with this little shirt. <laughs> and then we've got his shin guards and his green socks. Here's his green socks and then shin guards, they're inside these like white socks. These are different, they don't have the Velcro, they just go in these little sleeves and then I think they or better like stick maybe we've got his water bottle and we've got his soccer ball are you so excited he keeps saying let's go to soccer So yes, Grayson has his first soccer practice game. I don't know what to really call it. He's in like the littlest of the littlest leagues. So they really don't play each other. It's really just like introducing the sport to the kids. So I guess you could call it practice. But they get to wear jerseys every time and it's really cute. So this is through our local city schools. You just pay a fee and then it gets you into fall season and spring season, which is kind of nice. Just one fee for both. It's what only for it? kids who live in what the city like what limits. It? So it's all people in our city. Yeah. The only thing we don't have uh, for Grayson today is his cleats. I found a pair of cleats I really liked on Amazon, but it said that they were gonna take a while to get here. They did say that because of his young age, like they don't have to wear cleats. So I think just for this time, he'll wear like his normal um, gym shoes, tennis shoes, whatever you wanna call them. And then once we get the cleats in, he'll wear those next time. So this is just like a super low commitment sport. It's only on Saturdays. It's just for like two months. <laughs> it's only for 45 minutes. The place is like 15 minutes from our house. It's just like really low commitment because again, he's three. They're all gonna be three. I'm really nervous how he's gonna do because knowing Grayson, he has a attention span for about five minutes and then he gets tired of it. So we will see how it goes. Porter's gonna come. He's gonna cheer Gray Gray on. Say hi, Popoy. Hi, Popoy. Anthony's gonna come as well. We're all gonna cheer Gray on. Or keep him in line. I also have one of these pop camping pop-up chairs. I can't believe I'm one of those parents now where I like bring chairs to my kids' soccer, like sporting events and sit in the chairs. Like that just makes me feel really, really old. So I'm excited. Um, his games or practices, whatever you want to call them, are at nine in the morning. So thankfully, it's gonna stay pretty cool. It's supposed to get up to 90 again today. So thankfully, his games are not at like three in the afternoon at the highest of the day. So we will see how it goes. I'm a little nervous how Gray's gonna do. Um, Hopefully he likes it and hopefully he pays attention and um, hopefully I can just sit and watch him and not have to like go up there and like make him participate. <laughs> so we'll see how it goes. I'll try and record some of it if I can. Thankfully I will have Anthony with me so he can help out as well because uh, we will have Porter um, and my mom and two sisters are also going to come and watch as well. So I'm excited. Here's to the start of sports in our family. So we'll see where it takes us. Are you so excited for soccer? <gasps> Yay! The smallest shirt that they had was a size small. It's obviously way too big on him. So we have to tuck it into his shorts because otherwise it looks like a dress on him. <laughs> so we're excited. Here we go.
are you doing? Hi, Porter. Okay, so it's the next day. Grayson had an awesome time at soccer. Um, he did get tired. He did want to stop. 45 minutes is a long time for a three-year-old. He did really good. I was worried he was just like not even gonna participate and he did. And so he learned toe touches and toe taps or whatever they're called and rollovers. We like spin the ball one way or the other. So he had a really good time. It was really fun watching him. Porter did awesome. He just played around on the blanket. We brought chairs and a blanket. We watched Greg. It was really fun. It didn't get too hot, although it was still really humid that morning. So yeah, we will keep going every Saturday until Halloween and hopefully Grayson improves, so we'll see. There were some kids there that just cried the whole time and didn't want to get on the field at all, so at least Grayson wasn't that. So it was actually really fun. I'm so proud of him. This is just the start of our adventuring into the sports world, so I can't wait to see where it takes us. But anyway, we're just hanging out here. I'm about to put Porter down for a nap. We're babysitting my parents' dog, Berkeley, and we're about to go on a puppy walk, so. You say hi? Are you upside down, Gray Gray? That's so silly. You say bye-bye? Say bye. Bye-bye. Say bye, Gray. There it goes. Say bye, Gray. Say bye-bye, Porter. Bye, guys. See you later.